right there. <laughs> I'm Anika Moore, a beautiful and famous singer, actor, mother, and you're watching my new online series, Face to Face. <laughs> I'd like to introduce an amazing singer from New Zealand, one of our own. She loves long walks on the beach, probably yoga, and writing folk songs. Her music is loved in all corners of Aotearoa and she tours more than me, which I don't like, but I put up with. Welcome to the studio, Mel Parsons. Hi, Anika. Hi, Mel. Mm. Mel, or can I call you Puki Nana? <laughs> You've released three albums and are promoting your third right now. What inspired this album, Dry Lands? Uh, just life, really. Yeah. Yeah, you know, when you write songs, just what, what's happened to you and what you've been doing and people you've been seeing. And yeah. Yeah, places you've gone. Yeah. Yeah. That's it? Yeah, I think so. Okay, that's a bit of a boring. <laughs> well, you, sorry, we, we, can, yeah. we can rerun that question if you like. Go okay, so ask no, the question I'm again. Just, no, I'm getting straight to... <laughs> let's get straight to business. Mel, have you been watching The Bachelor? What do you think of art and all those girls? <laughs> oh, Copies fart? Oh, oh God! Do you like The Bachelor? I'm not. Do you like that kind of thing? Yeah, I, I've been away a lot lately, so I haven't been watching a lot of TV. So okay. I, yeah, but do you like The Bachelor? I'm obsessed with I Arthur thought Gray, so. or Art, as I, I like so. to call him. Okay, back to the band. Yeah, who's in your band? <laughs> uh, Jerry Paul, uh, who is a, an Irish Kiwi, yeah. who is my co-producer and. He is a guitarist. He actually or doubles up as a children's songwriter. songwriter as well. He does. Yes. yes, he's won some awards for that and written a book. Mine, no, great. mine's better. We all know that. But That's a given. Still, he's That's got a great kids album. Yes, uh, and my kids called, are obsessed with him. Yeah. Well, his music, you're not him. He's an unknown. So. <laughs> he's a crazy guy. Yeah. Um, and a guy called Christoph, who is he's also playing support for us. Yeah. And he is from the Netherlands, but he sounds Irish. Huh? Yeah, nice yeah, to yeah. meet you, yeah. eh? Do you have any fave moments from your crazy whirlwind career thus far? Uh, yeah, I have a lot. Yeah. I, um. I mean, obviously, all of the highlights are uh, when I've been on tour with you. And, and if you didn't know, Mel Parsons and I have toured quite a lot throughout the breadth and the width and the girth of this country. <laughs> Do you remember that time when uh, we were in Hastings yeah. and somebody threw a, <laughs> a, pair, a big pair of undies on stage and they'd yeah. written, I love you, a knicker <laughs> on it, and then they threw, also threw a dildo onto the stage. They threw so, a gorgeous vibrator onto the so stage and that was great. me for the night. Yes. Okay. Yes. Um, if you were me, who would you interview from the music industry? I guess what I'm trying to say is, who are your New Zealand idols, Mel? Well, <laughs> I love my new name, the, the rebranding with that. Um... Uh, I want to say Julia Deans. Oh, dude. Yeah. So what? Yeah. So I'm here. So yeah. this is me. Yeah. Where's Julia? Well, hang on, on the hang scale? on, hang on. Kay. Let's just yeah. put things well, in order. I like yeah, you. yeah, yeah. So where's Julia? She's somewhere in that vicinity. Okay, but not so. above. Probably no. Right. I wouldn't think okay, so. Cool. No, no. So who? 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 who, 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 who uh, uh, Don. Uh, Don, uh, uh, Don McGlashan. Oh, I love him yeah, too. Yeah, I love him. Yeah. And his new album, which is Anchor awesome. Anchor me. <laughs> cool. I've been listening to your new album, Drylands, quite a lot. My cat, really you. <laughs> my cat really loves it too. My fave songs are Driving Man and Get Out Alive. What are those songs about? Well, that's a great question, uh, Thank Anika. Thank you, I um, thought that was good. <laughs> uh, mm, parched. Well, Get Out Alive was actually, I had a little bit of a, um, a wee bit of a prang in my car. And when I say wee prang. Are you okay? I'm okay now, yeah, yeah. Oh, praise had, the Lord. Yeah, yeah. But I had a proper prang. I like rolled my car four times. Oh, and I wrote my car. Girl. But, but I'm fine. Yep, okay. I'm totally is that all you're going to say about it? Driving Man is all about you, so <laughs> I disguised you as I'm a the lesbian, man. but I'm not that lesbian. I, no, but I, I, I didn't want it to be too obvious. I didn't want the media to pick up on it. So. <laughs> that we're a couple. Okay. Yeah, exactly. God. Hey. I even wear this fake wedding ring. Oh, God. Oh, oh. that's right. How is Brownie up? Is he good? Is he good? Okay. Mel, what's your fave town to play in? Mine's Hokitika. Is it oh, really? Oh, Hokitika, for people who don't understand Māori <laughs> words. I played in Hokitika like three nights ago. Oh, did you play mm. at the fire station? Yes, I did. Was it good? Yes. Venue capacity? Uh, about 90. Not enough of me. Yeah. So you were. Hokitika, though. It's hook it, hook sold it, it, sold it, out, sold it. it. Yeah. Well, I'm just translating. Okay. So. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. For the white no, no, people. I don't know. Out there. No, uh, I don't know. 
know, there's so many good ones, eh? Nelson, maybe? I always have good uh. ones. <laughs> You're from Westport. How come you don't look funny and have no teeth and talk like this? I'm just gonna go out back, get my sheep, mama. How come you don't talk like that? I you talk know. so normally. I don't know. I don't, yeah. I mean, I guess I, I do still have a little bit of the Westport accent with me, but, um, <laughs> yeah. That's I, actually American you're speaking. Oh, uh, what? That's American that you're speaking. This isn't standard American, is it? It's standard American. Oh, That's where I got my, my oh, is, from. I'm so embarrassed. Oh. So you don't have that accent, like the Gore accent. Like, whoa, hey! That's just Nicky, from you have recent such, studies. Such a great cultural understanding of your country, and that's fantastic. And I think that's I'm why you're so Christ. connected with your audiences. Thank you so that's much, Mel. No, no, it's really. like kind of like you're interviewing me, but you're not. Okay, <laughs> shut the f- up. <laughs> what are your dreams for the future, Mel? Um, this is a serious question. Okay, is, do you want a serious answer? Yeah. Well, I want to keep touring, and uh, I want to keep writing records, yeah. and uh, yeah, I want to tour more in Canada again. Yeah. I just came back from there. Had a really oh. cool trip. Yeah. Yeah, Moose. Yeah. I, I was there for six weeks, and as you can see, I picked up a bit of an accent. Really got a really really standard American accent It's a really out and about accent. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay, quick yeah. questions, Mel. This yes. is the part where yes. I, I ask you questions quickly. Right. Ponytails or bowl cuts? Uh, yeah, bowl, bowl cuts, Do you like probably. ponytails? I do. Do you like yeah. them? Yeah, I do. Do you like them? I do, yeah. Do you like them? Yeah. Okay, put, uh, put ponytails there. Okay. Yeah. Sheeps or goats? <laughs> uh, sheep. Cool. That's the end of my quick fire questions. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Mel, this is the last question for you. Okay. And I'd, I'd never met you before, so this is a... How did you get all of these amazing and famous people to sing on your album, a.k.a. me? Uh, to be honest, um, people came to me, so I don't know if you remember, but you approached yep. me and, and pitched to be on the album. So, okay, yeah, I you kind of wanted to be on every song. We had to cut it okay, down cut a this, bit in the end. Let's cut this interview. But, um, cut this, shut, <laughs> shut, shut it. Shut it. Okay, it's been a delight having you, but you need to shut it. Don't laugh. Sorry, no laughing, sorry, serious. Sorry. Drink your antipodes. <laughs> end of interview.